How to Use Kiosk in CrewCard App In this video, you will learn that CrewCard have developed a kiosk feature. Some crew may not be able to access to their phone during shift as clients may require them to store in a locker. Clients or supervisor may use the kiosk within their CrewCard app to check in, start break, end break or check out on behalf of crew. Login into CrewCard app, enter your username and password. Then tap login button. Once you have logged into CrewCard app you will be directed to the homepage, tap the main menu. In the side menu, tap profile. Clients and supervisor can reset their kiosk pin by tapping reset button in their profile. You will notice a new kiosk pin has been generated. To access the kiosk, tap the main menu. In the side menu, tap kiosk. Note that staff can use the kiosk if they can't check in to their shift using the app on their device. It will direct you to the page wherein you need to enter the six digits kiosk pin. Enter the kiosk pin. Once kiosk pin has been entered you will be directed to the kiosk page. Select a location of the job where the crew is assigned. Select or tap the profile picture of the crew that you wish to check in. And tap check in button. Enter the kiosk pin of the crew. In an event that the client has one iPad or gadget on the job location, crew are required to check in by themselves else the client or supervisor will have to check in behalf of the crew. Once the kiosk pin has been entered, you will be directed to the confirmation window. The client has successfully checked in the crew on the given time and date. Tap OK to confirm. To add the break, simply tap the profile picture of the crew and select or tap the add break button. In case the crew doesn't have a break time, then they can tap check out. Select the start time of the break in the time picker. Once the start time of the break has been selected, tap OK. Enter the kiosk pin. Client has successfully start the break for crew on the given time and date, tap OK to confirm. To end the break, simply tap the profile picture of the crew and select or tap the end break button. Select the end time of the break in the time picker. Once the end time of the break has been selected, tap OK. Enter the kiosk pin. Once the kiosk pin has been entered, you will be directed to the confirmation window. Client has successfully end the break for crew on the given time and date, tap OK to confirm. To check out, simply tap the profile picture of the crew and select or tap the checkout button. Select the end time of the shift in the time picker. Once the checkout time has been selected, tap OK. Enter the kiosk pin. Once the kiosk pin has been entered, you will be directed to the confirmation window. The client has successfully check out for the crew on the given time and date, tap OK to confirm. The profile picture of the crew is marked as red, meaning the crew has already been checked out from the shift. Tap the time of the shift to view the timesheet. Timesheet will show the time when you have check-in, start break, end break and check out from the shift. Additionally you can see if the crew, supervisor, or the client who have made these activities. As mentioned earlier the red marked in the crew profile means the crew is already checked out, while the profile picture without color mark means the crew haven't checked in yet and green marked means that crew is already checked in. To exit the kiosk page, tap the X icon on the upper right corner of the screen. Client or supervisor will need to enter their PIN to exit kiosk, enter the kiosk PIN. Once the kiosk PIN has been entered you will be directed to the home page. Thank you for watching, if you have further questions or concern, Please send us an email at support at personnelmanager.com.au.